The name Shunji Iwai makes people reminisce back to the purity of youthful love in films. He is a representative of Japanese Impressionists and got famous by the movie Love Letter, which was released in 1995. Here at the 30th Tokyo International Film Festival, we have been fortunate enough to meet Asia's famous Japanese director, Shunji Iwai, and his work, Hannah and Alice. <笑>今回日本映画のミューズっていうことで Hannah and Alice touched the subtle feelings of adolescence that everyone has experienced. Two girls lie to each other in order to maintain their own love through a complicated love triangle. However, they eventually matured gradually and came to a mutual understanding. The movie kept alive Iwai's theme on youth and beautiful feelings, which is different than his other works. Hannah and Alice portray some resentment and melancholy, but also glimpses of youth and friendship. ま、本当にどの作品も作ってる時は比較的花と理想はま、恋愛期間が長かったかもしれないですね。そういう意味で言うと。Miki Sakai, Miho Nakayama and Yu Aoi, each moment of them feel the reality being bright and pure. It made the audiences connect with them. Shunji Iwai likes to use live performances to weaken the stage, which makes the main female roles maximize their performances through the movie. <laughs> 半分ぐらいがそういうフィールドで撮ってる気がするんですけど、あの、それに変えると、ま、学校って誰もが一応人通り経験してる場所なので、ま、そういう意味で、あの、いろんなこと描きやすい場ではあるかなっていうふうに思います。Fresh and unique, rich and delicate is what can be found in this youthful story and also part of Shinji Iwai's personal characteristic and style of work. Iwai did not only make a beautiful movie, but also restore all the wonderful memories of youth. あまり役者さんをこう、いかにこう、素敵に輝いてもらうかっていうのが自分の役割かなっていう気がするので、やっぱお客さんはその演じてる人を見るんだと思うんですよね。で、そこで感動したり、あの、ファンになったりしてると思うんで